got beautiful blue eyes, but do you want to take him back to my hotel and ravish him? <laughs> him at this moment in time, no. He's arrived with, like, teeth that look like <laughs> dinosaur teeth. I think some guys do find me quite intimidating. On the first day, I'll just say, oh, if we get to third day, if I really like you, then you can come in the hot tub. Yes. Firstly, can I get you a drink? Oh, yes, please. Dry white wine. A dry white. Yeah, that sounds good. Tell me, you and dating, what's going on? Every aspect of my life has been good. I've got two girls, I've been married, and I've done really well and been successful at work. I've built houses, but relationships, absolutely rubbish. I think when you're successful, sometimes it puts people off, doesn't it? You can be a bit overpowering for them, maybe. I don't know. But I'm very tenacious. I am going to find a man. And what sort of person do you want to meet? They've got to have hair. I like nice teeth, nice smile. I like sparkling, come to bed eyes. Come to um, bed eyes? Yes. The type of guy that I really fancy and would want to lick the clothes off would be a rugged silver fox. A rugby player type would be ideal, really. You ready for your date? Yes, very. I'm hoping this date will be tall, blonde, professional, from good breeding. I like a lady with a good set of boobs. Nice backside, long legs, strong. You've got nice blue eyes, by the way. <laughs> very sparkly. I like come to bed eyes. <laughs> It all looks very nice, doesn't it? Sorry about my glasses. My other ones are broken. I, I need them for no. I need them for. I'm reading. not that bad. <laughs> I need them for reading, and I went for an itis, and I've had to send them away. I'd rather see what I'm ordering. I think. I think I might have the red tie chicken curry. The chicken curry does sound nice, doesn't it? If we have the same, if we both smell, it doesn't matter, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but... How many dates have you been on? <laughs> Not many. I've had lots of dates. Yeah. You want it to be right, don't you? Mm -hmm. You don't want to make mm -hmm. a mess of it again. Mm. My problem is I've been a career person all my life. My drive was the end of my relationships, really. I have been married twice. Well, the first one, really loved him. He was the love of my life, really. I focused on my work. You know, I gave 150%. And I regret that now, in a way, because he left me for someone 10 years younger. Mm. I never in a million years expected it. It was heartbreaking when he left me, yeah. My partner used to say, oh, come for a walk, come for a walk. But when you work in sort of 14, 17 hour days, you're too tired to nurture a relationship. So now I've got older, I realise that. So you're gonna, are you semi-retired now, or are you still on the climb? No, 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 I'm semi-retired now. I've been there, I've been there, uh, that number one. I work really hard, so it's the time now for me. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Mm. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. Life's a living. Mm -hmm. Oh, exactly. Yeah. I think my first love was my soulmate. I think if I brought my standards on a little bit, I could have easily have been with someone now. But just, do you understand what I mean? I want it to be 100% right. Sorry, do excuse me. How are you doing? Oh, I'm lovely, thank you. How's your date going? He has got beautiful blue eyes, but do you want to take him back to my hotel and ravish him? <laughs> at this moment in time, no. So they've got to have nice hair and teeth, and he has got nice hair. Yeah. But he's arrived with, like, teeth that look like <laughs> dinosaur teeth, yellow and... Give him a chance and give it a chance. Give yourself a chance more than anything. Is... Yeah, but I am quite particular. <laughs> Mate, you feel like I'm really white. Yeah, they are. So how bad are your eyes? Why? So you joke? No, I've just had mine done, actually. I've just had them. What, later? And then next, I'm just having my, my teeth straightened and whitened next. They're terrible at the minute. Oh. Disgusting, but they will be right in the next six yeah. weeks. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, gosh. I need to look good for a young lady, doesn't I? Two tight curries. Oh, they look nice, thank you. Thank you. All right, well, I'll leave you to it. All right, enjoy. Did you like a bit of Thai? Mmm. Very nice. So what's happened with your wife? When did you um, split up then? Six years. 
No, I absolutely adored her. And I mean, like, worshipped her. I was married for 23 years and with her for 25. I used to doubt on her. I used to do anything for her. I'd get up, cook her breakfast, or pack her up and, and get her out the door. Yeah, I'll probably still be with her if, mm. if we could have sat down and talked about it, but she wanted to move on. Was it her decision? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. One day, she said, that's it. Divorce. Don't want nothing to do with you. You'd think you'd sit down and have a chat, and, but she'd know. It was her way or no way. I mean, the biggest yeah. mistake I made was I didn't have my own interest, so everything I did was with the family. I should have gone to rugby more and... and, and yeah. To be fair, I think I loved her more than she loved me. You were really down, obviously. Yeah. So what are you looking for now, then? Someone to grow old with. Mm -hmm. I need somebody who understands what I do. Do you like rugby at all? Have you never been? My first love, he was massive into rugby, so I used to go and watch him. One of the girls um, down the rugby club, she's had terminal cancer, and she was looking for, for volunteers for, for doing a full Monty. All oh, right, OK. So I've actually done three full Montys in front of 160 screaming women. Did you? Yeah, yeah. And I tell you what, I'm ready for anything. <laughs> he's really nice. And he said, bless him, he's getting his teeth done. His teeth are horrendous. I do think... Your teeth situation will make you look a lot better. Oh, yeah, definitely. So you should have your eyes done as well. Quite a long time. Get rid of the glasses. Yeah, but it's only for readers. Yeah, but... I can see you. I can see the beautiful blue eyes. Can you? Well, that's good. That's good. My date was lovely. It's not easy to find a man like that that is driven, that's successful. He had so many boxes that were ticked. Do you like being the boss or do you want to be No, equal? no, not at all. I'm quite, like, I'm very compliant. Mm. Oh, yeah? Are you going to see each other again? Ladies first. I think so, do you? Yeah. Mm. Oh, well, oh, listen, I, nice. I, I think I would give it another go. Yeah, I definitely yeah. would. Yeah. I'll get my own back. Well, how will you get your own back? Just you can take me out again. All oh, right. <laughs> when I saw you, I could see those beautiful, beautiful blue eyes. You were driven, you had that edge that I like. And you said you're having your teeth done. Yeah, I'm having my teeth done as well. 